uh, keep, keeping this to politics? Don't you think that uh, maybe the president could be using politics, uh, or, or, or not really politics, governance, to so settle political issues? With who now? With the Ruto. Uh, okay, I think Ruto jumped ahead uh, before, uh, before these things were settled in terms of even 2022. Because, look, take it for example, it is Ruto who produced himself as a hustler, a candidate, presidential candidate, and then he branded the other guys that they are dynasty. That is Raila Odinga, the, the Gideon Moi, and the Uru Kenyatta, that is the dynasty. But then he got it wrong because William Samoei Ruto has never voted outside dynasty since 1992. He voted for Moi, that was dynasty. 97, he voted for Moi, that was dynasty. 2002, when the entire country knew that Kibaki was going to win, and Kibaki was a hustler, he voted for Uhuru, who is a dynasty. 2007, there were hustlers, he voted for Raila, who is a dynasty. And then in 2013, he voted for Uhuru, who is a dynasty. 2017, he voted for Uhuru, dynasty. So he has never voted for hustlers. We've had so many hustlers. Ekura Okot, Mwalimudida, and the rest. He has never voted for them. So William Ruto has voted for dynasty. He cannot come out all of a sudden to teach us not to vote for dynasty. We will vote for dynasty because that's the pattern he has taught us. Well, well, Ken, Ken, those are some of the <laughs> opinions of Kisumu residents here. As you can hear from the background, this is a topic that has caused a lot of excitement here. Of course, as I've mentioned there before, is that uh, the 2022 politics